Hello everyone, welcome back to my tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to model this machine component using Creo Parametric. Let's go to the software, new, we are going to model as a solid model, part modeling. Untick this use default template, click OK. We are going to, we are going to use MM as a unit, choose MM solid absolute, click OK. Now just go to the model. Now I am going to extrude this complete one in a single throw. For that total length is 16 plus 19 plus 15 plus 40. Similarly 15 plus 19 and 16. The total length is 140 and the height is 56. Okay. Just go to the model. I am choosing this front plane. Sketch. Sketch view. First draw the center line. Press roller to confirm. Now, now I'm going to draw a symmetric rectangle. Press roller to confirm. This distance is 140, and this distance is 56. Now click this fit screen. Now go to the model. 56. This is 140. 140 distance. Now. From the center, we just want to ink. Uh, the, the center point of the circle is from the center 15 radius. Okay. For that, center uh, distance they are not mentioned, but actually the center is here. Okay. Go to line, go to circle, first circle, and second circle. Press the roller to confirm. Now the distance is 15. Now just go here. The inner diameter is 40 and outer radius is 35 they are giving. That means inner diameter is 40 and out, outer circle diameter is 70. This diameter is 40. This one is 70. Now delete unwanted edges. Go to delete segment. Delete this edge, this edge, this one, this result. Delete this edge. Go to delete segment. This edge, this edge, and this edge. Now press the roller to confirm. Now we can generate the surface of this. Okay. Now just click OK to confirm. Now go to extrude. Just now the extrusion length is 30. Change this into symmetric. This distance is 30 mm. Now just click OK to confirm. Now go to the model. The radius is 15. For this, select this particular edge. Go to round. The radius of the round is 15. Similarly, select press the control and select this edge also. The same 15 radius will apply to this edge also. Then click OK to confirm. Now we have model. Now one more feature we just missed it that is old. For that go to edit. Right click this. Click the sketch. Here there is option called edit drawing. Go to here. Go to sketch view again. Now this wall we just want to make there are four walls this whole diameter they are not mentioned the same diameter is we will take the diameter is 10 the distance from bottom is 28 and distance from side is 16 just go here select the circle and press order to confirm this distance is 28 and this is 16 the diameter is 10. 
go to the model again the diameter is 10 from the bottom it is 28 and from the side it is 26 16 now click ok to confirm now we have created this single circle we can mirror the other one just select this no just go to sketch again edit similar circle we just want to make here also only this distance we just want to specify this is 16 just click ok now we have modeled this one go to this complete portion we have done the remaining portion this two thing we just want to make now our datum place in the middle we just want to move this datum plane from middle to the distance of 20 any one of the side from there we just want to create go here select this one yeah choose this plane option give 20 and press enter now just click ok here we just want to draw this plane I have chosen sketch go to sketch view sketch view now just go to reference click this two edges as a reference just close this one now go to the model there are two circle one is the radius of 10 another one is the diameter is 10 and we just want to make a line of 40 for that just perpendicular and just make it and then we just want to go to circle first circle second circle just click roller to confirm now just create a one more line at the bottom and again press roller to confirm now just click this point and connect this with the tangent and press the roller to confirm again press the roller to confirm now we just want to specify inner and outer diameter inner diameter is 10 outer diameter is 20 go to delete segment remove this unwanted edge again press the roller to confirm now just go to the model now radius we have the height is 40 and this height is 45 go to the model dimension choose this edge click here this is 40 mm and this distance is 45 now click ok to confirm now just rotate your object extrude go to the thickness is 15 change this into 15 mm now just click ok to confirm one side we have made this one similarly we just want to make other side also for that select this extrude go to mirror choose this center plane we have mirror it then just click ok to confirm now we have modeled our compute geometry now to view and select this one shaded with edge just go to the model the same model we have done just go to view appearance give this yellow click this part and click ok now we have modeled our geometry. Thank you for watching my videos. Please subscribe my channel for more videos. If you have any other method to draw the same component in the easiest way, please comment me. Or if you found any difficulty of drawing this component, please comment me. Thank you.